morning. So hello. Uh, by now, hopefully, you will have received a stick or a pack from um, Rumpus Room. This is the first episode of Lines and Sticks, all about the stick, stickism, sticketism, whatever. Stick it to somebody. Stick it to the man. Stick up for yourself. Stick up for others. Uh, this one is one I've got painted white here uh, for you to maybe do some designs or drawing or writing slogans like my brother is so annoying uh, why can't we all just get along end poverty now um, black lives matter you might think of other slogans or other things that you're thinking about. Healthcare for all, um, etc. You know, you can think of ones that you might like to write on it. So this can be a bit like a protest stick that when you're um, dragging along behind you like a little dog, people might ask you and say, what's that? What's this all about? And uh, you can talk to them if you wish or not talk to them. It could be something you want to share or something like a secret doesn't matter or you can just say this is my dog his name is uh gucci or something and um tell them a little bit about yourself or why you're taking this about the streets and um, meeting people uh, i also wondered if you could share anything you do with the stick whether if you paint it or draw on it or take it for a walk or hit it against the lamppost or other ideas you might have. That one's quite a dull one, actually. Um, there are better ones. I think this one here, actually, this is more like um, an older model and much, much better tone. Uh, I'm sure you'll find some nice ones near you or in your area. There's also a love this uh, kind of thing. But um, that's just some railings. There's some wooden ones actually over here. Let me go back here. It's quite nice. Mm. Some interesting sounds. You could try them all out. Um, come up with different things to do. Maybe swishing the grass about. I don't know. Um... Yeah, sh share any of your ideas you have. These are some of my ideas. Of course, they're not original at all. Uh, everyone has thought of these sort of things before. But it's just sharing a bit of fun to do with uh, sticks. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, I'll talk to you in a second when we're going to go back to um, the stick's more natural habitat. I mean, you might find them. If you lose that stick or you can't get to Rumpus Room, there are, of course other sticks there on the street or here on the street or in the mud over here or by side the curb there sticks sticks are everywhere but yeah uh, I'll speak to you in a second when we go back to our the more natural habitat good luck everyone all right now that was about two seconds but um here's another one look quite dull but then we have this Yeah, much, much more interesting. Yep, here's another one. So I have to stop again. Also, if you're interested in any mutual aid, here you go. I remember mutual aid's not just for COVID or Christmas. It's for every day of the year. You can look into that. Raspberries. Street, street raspberries. The good thing about being out and about in the uh, street is there's, there's actually lots of things to hit and, uh, you know, make noise with. That's quite good with that sign as well. Good uh, reverb on that one. Softer, more percussive sound.
What do the objects say? I'm sure about this one, but let's give it a go. Hmm, more uh, mutual aid there, look. Combing bushes there, that's quite nice. We're nearly there, just a couple more blocks. design. If you um, look in here, you'll see some of the sticks in their natural habitat there. Look. Quite you know, quiet, not really saying much. I'll go through here. And here, look. literally thousands of them so don't worry if you lose your stick or it gets broken or someone steals it or um, you know for whatever reason maybe you just grow tired of the one you've got there's loads more really I mean little ones big ones fat ones thin ones round ones jaggy ones wonky ones you know, some that have been here a long time and some that are quite new and still a bit like wet with the, um, you know, the sap in the, in, in the tree, maybe freshly pulled off the branch or something. It's, but I do think it's better to get the older ones, actually. But, you know, just have a walk around and see if you can find a stick that kind of speaks to you that, for whatever reason, is, you know, saying things that you like to hear thinking stickish thoughts, doing stickish things. Um, yeah, and have fun. Uh, that's the first part, okay, is to do with getting your stick, getting out in the open and um, take it for a walk 
Um, for those of you who don't have pets like myself, it's kind of a chance to try out what it's like to have a pet or, you know, look after something and a great way to meet people as well. Lots of chat, um, all kinds of chat with people when you take a stick for a walk. Uh, you know, you have, you have to be persistent, you have to do it for a while um, so that people get comfortable with the idea of you having a stick for for a, a pet and taking it on a walk and after a while people will start to be more comfortable and they'll they'll begin to ask you questions yeah so the important thing is just to have fun uh, and yeah enjoy your time with your stick I hope you get up to some great stuff and remember to share it with Rumpus Room okay bye bye